Well, welcome along to Ainsley Park after the international break and this appointment for Scotland. We'll try and hopefully see some good action before the winter break in the SWPL1. And here at Ainsley Park, it is Spartans up against Glasgow City who have had the perfect start to the league campaign so far. Obviously through to the Champions League last 32 as well. Of course, City with the new pink kit, but a special edition kit today with the UN's. 16 days against violence against women and in partner with Women's Aid and we're in that kit today. Space open up for Wojcik now by one. Decent dig and just over the bar from Shea Wojcik looking for her first goal. And City Colours just bounced through and space was there. Well, City's number 15 just didn't quite come down. Good ball there, it's again white and red jersey get forward, Galbraith coming in and again flag didn't go up and well that was an opportunity for the top scorer so far in this campaign. Shot me in, was off target from the close range. That's Lewis and Gillen straight back to Spartans and Macaloni. Mason by Wojcik and Mason strike it's a fantastic save from Aaron Clackers uh, it's a tremendous save from the city goalkeeper there's a strike which is heading into that corner top corner now McElroy roving down that channel once more trying to get round Toland does Galbaith coming in that's another chance for Spartans. Couldn't get it down, throw the header. Maka only caught some problems down that far side. Calvary just came right on top of her head, couldn't get it towards goal. And said he survived there. Loves that flick there, Robertson trying to turn away. Is that a penalty? It is the challenge from Dio McMahon. And suddenly so having had too many chances, but they're going to get one from the spot in the 22nd minute. So, Dion Ross from the spot. Rolls it comfortably. And they haven't been at their best so far, but 22 minutes on the clock. The breakthrough for Glasgow City at Ainsley Park. Dion Ross's third goal of the season and rolled calmly in. Keeper went the wrong way. And the breakthrough for the champions. Thanks, Paul, for a wine. By one, and he's going to get it back here from Cobble. Lovely play. It's a great finish, Zanetta Wine. What a link up. First city goal for Zanetta Wine. She's set up one or two so far. But the link up with Cobble was superb and coolly taken finish. And uh, since City got the first, they've had more possession at that final third and now they've got a second in the 38th minute so it's Wade and Ross both over the ball certainly after the first 20 minutes if City scored a third that would be a big surprise in the complexion of the game it is Wade oh hit the woodwork now our only goal was the the one back in that Champions League quarter final, and that wasn't far away from a first league goal of Glasgow City. <laughs> <laughs> well, that slide there from 
Joe Love as Mason came through and Galbraith has rolled it in and Barton's back in the game 90 seconds into the second half Becky Galbraith has scored in City in the past was passed did it and the Neymar City won 12 in a row back in, the back end of 2018 Goal. and the slip from Joe Love ball across and Galbraith with a third goal of the season wait for Fulton Wade's going to get it back here Mojek quiz furthest forward, that's going to loop in and I think Macaloni it was the boot that came off and yeah, it was a whipping ball in and City have restored the two goal cushion with a little bit of fortune five and a half minutes into the second half as Wade to take the corner Fulton trying to get a foot in there Another scrum this time, fully. There's Tolan trying to drill through a gap which was closing. Wojcik. Oh, oh skipped by Marshall. Oh, that's a tremendous try. From Shea Wojcik. I should find a pocket of space. But whistle by the goal. So that was touch from Toland as Simone McMahon got back and I got it back I should say. <laughs> now it's space for Davidson to roam forward. Shine and Wade, Wade in the far side is screaming for it a little bit but now opens up for full tent. Oh, it's another good try. It's off the crossbar. And Maddie Fulton for number four, potentially. That could have been again a threat from outside the box for the strikes. Great play it was. Space is there and had a dig. To keep an intensity up here. Mm -hmm. 20 minutes or so of the game. Davidson. Oh, it's going to come for Shine. Davidson takes over. Davidson. Lauder blasts it over. That should have been 4 1 there. I think they're kind of getting the range of there, Shine and Davidson, but it came through to Davidson. Looking for a first goal in first team city colours. Yeah, it fell for here though, but over the bar, it's on the close range, stays at 3 1. Davidson and Shine in that foot race with McMahon. Finds help in Davidson. Oh, it's a clever little try. Fingertips and crossbar. A nice little cute effort, which. I had to have the fingertips of Harrison just to make sure. Mains 3 1. Wade's corner. Crichton, Buckley, and spinning around looking for it. That fall for her. There's Toland. Back with Wade. And got by one fortuitously. She's going to try herself, and Harrison has to put it around the post. Space just opened up when she got by Douglas and went for that sneaky near post one. Well met by Harrison. Loads of space for Davidson. Shine back with Lauder. Nice little ball for Wine. Shine. <laughs> Might well just stay in for Wayne. Oh, goodness me, it has. Well, if it comes to a goal from this, it'd be incredible as fully sails it in. And it wasn't far away from it. And Davidson couldn't get it on target. Yeah, a missed cross shot 
Adam Shine almost swept into a goal at the other end, but not quite for the wayside. And that's game over at Ainsley Park and Glasgow City with three goals and the three points in Edinburgh. Oh, a difficult first 20 minutes or so, but they settled down thanks to a penalty which was converted by Leanne Ross. A wonderful bit of play, link up play of the Ether Colville and Zanetta Wine. Ended up with Wine scoring just before half time. There was a goal back from Rebecca Galbraith for Spartans, but a uh, was own goal for Kieran McAloney, making things 3 1 and fairly comfortable for the away side for the remainder of the match. And it's another win to keep up the 100% record for City at Ainsley Park. It's Champions League duty in the Czech Republic on Wednesday against Sparta Prague before a big game to finish off the league campaign before the winter break against Rangers next Sunday. But final score at Ainsley Park, Spartans 1, Glasgow City 3.